Hey guys, look what I've got today from HTC Middle East. The HTC Desire 12 and HTC Desire 12 Plus. The two phones that brings the new longer 18 ratio 9 screen format at a lower cost. So let's do the unboxing of the special royal gold color for both. But before I start the video, kindly subscribe to my channel and also hit the bell icon. So you will get notified every time I post a new video. So first of all, a big thanks to HTC Middle East for giving these units for unboxing. Also, they have their own YouTube channel, HTC MA, if you like to see some of their contents. I'm sure they will be making some cool contents for the upcoming smartphones in their own YouTube channel. So kindly subscribe to them. So let's start with the unboxing. So here are the devices, both are royal gold color but the Desire Plus is more muted gold than the smaller version. Both of them look stunning but it comes down to personal preference, which one you like more. HTC is giving 48 hours express replacement or repair service for both these devices which is commendable. Also with the Desire Plus you get 3 months of VIU application, premium subscription, free of charge. Basically, you can watch latest movies or TV series in this application in various languages. Now let's keep them aside and see what we have got inside the box. There is no fast charger for both. You get 5 volt normal adapter, micro USB cable for charging and a pair of ordinary earphones. The Desire Plus got the same content inside the box except for the long 5V adapter. Let's now boot up the devices for the first time and do the initial setup. So now both the devices are done with the setup. The display looks just about decent on both. Nothing great but it's a mid-end device so no complaint. The Desire 12 is running Android 7.1.1 Nougat and Desire 12 Plus is running Android 8.0 Oreo out of the box. The cameras on Desire 12 Plus is better than the Desire 12 with dual lens setup. Here are some sample images. So starting with the Desire 12, the Desire 12 has a 5.5 inch screen with less bezel around the side and offers a single 13 megapixel sensor on the rear of the phone with an f2.2 aperture sensor. It's got 2 GB of RAM with 16 GB on board storage or 3 GB if you go for 32 GB capacity. And both variants are capable of handling up to 2 terabyte of micro SD card space. Inside is a MediaTek quad-core CPU which hints at a lower cost for the phone. That means a resolution of 720 into 1440. The HTC Desire 12 Plus pumps things up a little and will clearly be the more expensive of the two, although has the same lower resolution. The main change is to the camera on the rear of the phone with 13 megapixel sensor joined by a 2 megapixel option. So it's a dual setup designed to give some background blur bokeh effect. The HTC Desire 12 Plus is also running a Qualcomm Snapdragon 450 CPU under the hood. These are the specifications for both the devices. The price of the phones in UAE for Desire 12 and 12 Plus are 599 AD and 749 AD respectively. In India, it is priced at 11,250 and 14,000 Indian rupees. Overall, HTC has done good effort to bring two good devices 
in the ever competitive mid-end smartphone market with a decent price but let's see how it performs between the two devices my vote will definitely go for desire 12 plus because of a better processor which is snapdragon and also a decent camera compared to the desire 12 with mediatek processor which is difficult to recommend over a snapdragon processor that's all guys from this video i hope you enjoy the video i will see you in my next video soon till then goodbye peace out i hope you enjoy the video if you like the video kindly hit the thumbs up and subscribe to my channel i will really appreciate that also click on the notification icon the bell icon so you will constantly get updated with my new videos thank you for watching and see you in my next video till then goodbye